Greetings everyone, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda, Death in the Wild. In today's episode, we're finally going to go to Hateno Village, which is... Um... Okay. That way! There it is. Now, hey. the last episode, before I got rudely interrupted by a star piece falling out of the sky, I was looking for a place over here to do a nice little transition where I jump up in the air, and then I land, and all of a sudden I'm on Epona, and it would have been awesome everything. But you know what? I just really, really want to paraglide there. So I'm going to do that. And I don't know why I ran. I'm Now you're going to run out of stamina before you reach it. Yeah. Hmm. We'll see about that. Aha. Uh -huh. uh. So, what were you going to say? Was I going to say anything? Sounded like he was going to say something. Maybe. And there goes your stamina. And there goes... I don't know what you're talking about. An energizing about. fish skewer. I still have plenty of stamina. Hey, look at that house off by itself. That looks like a nice house. Yeah, I should buy that house. Hmm. You know what else I see? A shrine. A shrine. It's a floor shit. <laughs> Shrines and floor shit, huh? Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Those poor Bokoblins are in trouble! I must save them! Come here, you! I must save the Bokoblin! Oh no! I accidentally killed the Bokoblin! Ah, well, good riddance. I'll just take his tooth. You there! No! Megan! No! Megan! Fine, I don't want to talk oh. to you anyway. Megan Excuse me, sir. Out. What seems to be the trouble here? Why aren't you responding to my sword slashes? It is a Hyrulean. This is, I can't remember what the joke was anymore. Stop, Wake up! Stop breaking your weapons against the ground. I never even saw them coming. This is exactly why I didn't want to go truffle hunting. Lousy gnat. What? No reward. Yeah, this is one where you don't. We get were a minding reward. our own business, hunting for truffles, and then wham! A link out of nowhere. He just beat the shit out of those Bokoblins. But they were just minding their own business. Hardy truffles. Does that mean there are some around here? You give me something. We're traveling all over to find hardy truffles. I know, I know. It's dangerous for two folks to travel on their own these days. You don't have to tell me twice. When I think about how wonderful those truffles taste. All the worries and warnings melt away. Yeah. You know what won't melt away? Arrow is in your torso. Because you need to reward the person who saved you. There's your reward. What a waste of a bomb arrow. It makes me feel better. Pick up that fang. I already picked it up before you said anything. Put away your bomb arrows. No, I'm gonna hold it down until it explodes. Doesn't it not explode? Exactly! That means I'm holding it out forever. Well, until you kill two birds with it and get roasted drumsticks. They huh? were raw! They didn't cook them. They, sh they should have been oh, cooked. Oh, I'm entering a village. Uh, my clothing doesn't look quite right. I better fix that. And before he takes his shirt off. There we go, perfect. And after he takes his shirt off. What? You really want to put that pitchfork up at me, buddy? Yeah. You're not even going to use it. Who are you? Be on your way, you suspicious man! I'm, I'm a traveler. traveler. You certainly do appear to be a Helene like the rest of us. Helenes are generally good folk and wear clothes. Sorry for getting all worked up. You're free to go. We're just a waypoint on your winding road, huh? Ah, the life of a traveler, wandering around without pants. Well, you can go get most things you need at the general store, like pants. In the end, just back there, like pants. You should really put on pants. I don't wanna. This is pantsless quest. <laughs> no, it isn't. <laughs> don't even lie to me. <laughs> Tree. <laughs> apples. Tree falling. Wood. Link's got wood, yo. There's an apple in that bush. There's a house. Let's invade the house. There's nothing in this house. Boo! No explosions. I can't go forward. <laughs> well, you can try not wanting directly into the door. Oh, I can't sleep in their beds. This isn't Skyward I saw sword. something glowing over here. Ah, potlit. Mine. He was a strange man. He ran into our house. Half naked. And stole our stuff. Tried to sleep in our beds. 
And all he stole from us was his farming hoe and a pot leg. Oh, That's wait. It, sir. I thought that was a sledgehammer for some reason. I did too at first. I saw the name. <laughs> because I used my skills of observancy. Ho! Oh. Ah, hey, a traveler. What's going on? Are you lost? Where are you looking to go? Uh, a strange place. Very strange place. A very strange place. Mm -hmm. Oh, a very strange place, huh? Only one place you could mean. The easternmost structure in this village, at the top of the hill, young. Yep, you mean the Hateno Ancient Tech Lab, right? Mm hmm. I don't know. How strange is it? Its direction does research. It, it, I'm sorry. Its director does research. They're every day, supposedly to help keep us all safe. But who knows what that means? That director doesn't like kids at all much, so I hear the village gets curi- The bleh. The village dykes get curious and snoop around a lot. I can't read today. Looking for anything else? A strange place. Huh. That can mean a lot of- Oh, wait! Are you talking about our re resident Mr. Toothy? Tootie? Did I read that right? Toothy? Toothy. Toothy. That's a weird name. I mean, his shop's not called that. We all- Blah blah blah. Somebody else read this. I'm fumbling too much. I think only I call him that. He runs a dye shop near the bridge. He is weird. Yep, his real name is Sage, and he's definitely a master of dying clothes. But he's also a master of weirding me out. <laughs> you looking for something else? Maybe. If you want somewhere to rest, any is a usual choice for travelers. But maybe you mean the model houses behind a general store. Bolson Construction. Yeah, they put those up. Nice beds, okay <laughs> furniture. They got the brand new house smell. Wouldn't mind sleeping in that smell just once. Bye bye. You're good then. All right, whatever. Well, you can only have the new house smell once. Well, where's my customary village welcoming and showing around? I. You've got the look of a traveler. Is this your first time in Hateno Village? Maybe. Well, you're in luck, as you have a lifelong residence to show you around. Sure. Okay. Let's get you a good old-fashioned dose of Hateno hospitality. The shop in my, is in my daughter's capable hands these days, so I've got a lot of time on my hands. I thought it might be nice to do a good turn for the village where I was born and raised. Sorry, I did that wrong. Volunteer so guy. Tour guide. Stick with me and I'll show you around the best parts of this place. In fact, in just a minute, I'll show you something really special. Ooh. Well, I wanted a guide. I got one. Yay! Sweet. General goods. This is the general store East Wind. They sell a lot of everyday goods and even some everyday greats. And now, on with the tour. Man, he's pretty fast for a guy his size. You really shouldn't smack him like that. Just make this take longer. <laughs> You're making this take longer, Michael. I'm walking normal speed and I'm going faster than this guy. Come on, speed it up. Aha. Uh -huh. This is the Kochi Dye Shop. Known for their potato dyeing. They'll dye your clothes whatever color you like. And now, on with the door. My clothes are already dead. Why would I kill them again? Okay, now you just did that one on your own. We, we live, live to die. die. <laughs> Lovely. They had to know what they were doing with that name. Oh. That outfit you're wearing, it looks so dashing. So heroic. <laughs> oh, my outfit? Is it lovely, isn't it? Actually, I had this custom made. This isn't weird to you at all, is it? Two strangers on the road, praising one another's inc impeccable taste. Or lack thereof. I'm in my birthday suit! Maybe if I take my cap off. Ah. Nope, nothing new. Mumble, mumble. Grumble, grumble. Is this tour almost over? It's getting dark. <sighs> Here's Tom Poo in. If you need to sleep overnight, then this is the place. And now on with the tour. Well, that was. This is a long tour. Seriously. He showed you everything. He went way out of the way to say that small little line. He could have just pointed at it and say that building over there. Hey. Uh, uh. He's actually booking it pretty well for a fat guy. Oh no, you think Link would be really fat with how much he shoves in his mouth. Hey, it's a Monster Quest uh, quest board. Actually, I haven't shoved much in my mouth Monster in this quest? game. I, meant Monster I Hunter. need to cook more. Monster Hunter quest board. Should probably take a quest. Ah. That's no tourist, touristry for the day. But don't fret, this village ain't going anywhere. You can come back tomorrow. 
Maybe I'll be more awake then. Wait, did you? Knife flipped over, so he went back to bed. Oh, he didn't finish his tour. Yeah. Jackass. Oh, hey, he's selling clothes here. What are pants? I've never heard of pants. Get in there. Fine. I want to see what he sells. He won't let me in. Darn it, you let me in. Well, let's see. We got some Helene trousers, a hood, and a tunic. Ooh. And you've got the Hylian armor. Soldier For the gear. soldier set. I've only got 133 rupees to my name. That armor right there has some of the best defense in the game. Hi. Welcome, welcome. People who like clothes just love it here at... <laughs> Inventus Clothing. Did you need something? Uh... You pants? Like this corner? Uh. Oh! Am I nestled too far in the corner? It is it hard to see me? I know it's a little weird, but I just feel more confident over here. Did you need anything else? Maybe I some see pants? didn't miss her the first time. What is this place? We're a clothing shop with lots of apparel to choose from. No more where to adventure to wear. You'll find it where? Right where? Did you need anything else? Like pants? Hey, no, I'm good. Sell some stuff and see if you can get enough money to buy this full set of armor. I doubt you can right now. He's grinding his teeth in his sleep. That's not healthy, man. I'm talking to the wall now. I'm here to sell. What, what was I waiting on? I think it's because she lacks confidence. Uh, I don't have anything I really want to sell. Hey, Amber. Well, you have a lot of gemstones. Yeah, gemstones. But, uh... I don't think this will be enough. Oh, Maybe. actually it might be. Maybe not. Mm, I do need to sell some stuff, though, for something. Let's see here. Topaz. Let's sort my inventory and make sure all the gems are in one spot. Where'd they go? We I'm lost. them twice. Oh, here they, they are. are there, okay, there. I don't want to sell those. I want to save them. Yeah, those I'll are sell all important. these. Let's see. How much am I going to get? 300. That'll work. And I'll go ahead and sell all the amber, too. Yeah, 92 Bokoblin uh, horns. Yeah, and I'm probably going to need them. Yep. It's crazy the amount of those things you can pick up. That's it for now. I am not going to spend this on any clothing right now. There's something much more important I need to take care of first. Well, how much does the whole armored set cost again? Too much. But I wanted to know. Too much. You suck. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Ah, you're doing this first. Let's go visit the construction company. Is this a bounty board? A new age of comfort. Bolson Construction homes ooze quality from every seam. Explore our model homes today. I'm pretty sure you don't have enough money for this. You know what else they ooze from every seam? Wow, I lost where I was going with that. Masculinity. They they ooze staples. This this place is held together with staples. It's hip to be square. Dun, dun, da, 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 da. It's hip to be square. Thanks, Robert. Right, that's my Seriously, smack. all these Good houses just look like some child's uh, freaking... Uh, what are they called? The, those log things you played with as a kid. Lincoln Logs, yeah. Yeah, it looks like someone just put slapped something together at Lincoln Logs, and now it's a home. Link and Logs. <laughs> well, <laughs> Link, Link is inside logs. of this log. I don't think these ever actually have anything in it. I don't think meaning. so. They're homes, but no one uses them. That's actually kind of sad. Well, except just... for that one. That one gets kind of used. What's with this house? I don't know, but its chimney looks a little poor. Like it could come down at any moment. Somebody really needed to fix that thing. They're hitting this house. It's mine now. I claim it. It's mine. I'm sleeping here. This is a really big empty place. Big empty room. Empty room. Yeah. Looking mighty <laughs> free there, eh? The other day, another ruby. Who are you? I just started a Bolson construction. Name is Carson. My trial period is done, and they finally hired me as an official member of the Bolson family. I'm so glad to have my name in Son, you know? Son? Yep, you heard me right. Apparently, your name has to end in Son to work at Bolson Construction. 
The boss was there was saying he's really looking into expanding the business. But I'm wondering, just how many folks are there are out there with names ending in sun? Maybe lots? Hello. Hello. Whew. This house isn't looking any less demolished despite all this effort. What are you doing? Working, as you can see. This old house here has been abandoned. Everyone in Atena Village agreed we should demolish it. The old owner apparently went off to the castle to report for service. Never came back, never wrote, so away it goes. Hard work, huh? <laughs> yep. I wouldn't want it any other way, to be honest with you. Let's go see what this guy has to say. Oh, that hair. Mm -hmm. It's glorious. Who are you? I'm a carpenter for Bolson Construction. Name's Hudson. Hudson Hawk? What are you doing? I'm knocking this place down. Why? Because no one's living here. Why? The owner of this house took off. Why? Mm. Don't know? Maybe skip town without paying the bills? Oh. Answered all your questions? Yes. Good. A lot has happened since the Great Calamity. Tough to keep track of it all. Right. I don't know what it is about Hudson. For the first time since then, we're finally getting back on our feet. Good. <laughs> so best of luck to both of us. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what it, I don't know what it is with Hudson. Oh. Hello. But he always Link always gives him one word answers. I'm knocking this place down. Unless, you know, it's that sounds tough. Real multiple choice. That's right. It's tough. <laughs> I don't I don't get it either, but yeah. You know what? Oh. I should talk to him a bit. Oh, wait. I never noticed him back there before. I talked to you. Wait, don't they tell me to go talk to him? Yes. I think so. What are you doing? I'll buy this place. Can't help you. Ask the boss. Yep, that's what I thought. The boss must be this very strange, garish-looking gentleman. Oh, my. Aren't you perky? Well, then. Need something from me? Who are you, weird man? Me? I'm the luminary, president, architect, and design load of the Bolson Construction. My name is Bolson. He's a design load? What's he a load of? Crap? With love, courage, and hopeful hearts, we give every house a new start. That name again is Bolson. Yeah, yeah. B -b 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 Bolson Construction. I'm not doing that. Definitely not doing that. Shall we? Shadowser. Huh? You don't know this dance? I thought it was all the rage with the kids these days. You must be out of the loop. Anyway, if you don't need anything urgent, wanna give me some space? You wanna say that again? <laughs> oh my, aren't you perky? What are you doing? In case it's not obvious, I'm demolishing a vacant house. Times are rough. Not a lot of buyers, you know. So the villagers decided it was best to just tear it down. Sounds dull. I can buy it! Oh. Whoa, get a load of young money bags here. Just wants to buy it, huh? Okie do. Let me lay it out for you. See this house? Been vacant for years. So the villagers had a meeting, argued, voted, and decided to tear it down. The demolition costs, with associated fees, Permits and other such details come in about, ooh, 50,000 rupees. Yeah. Can you even hold that much? Yes. So when you say you want to buy it, you're talking about 50,000, right? Uh, impossible <laughs> <laughs> Figured. When I was your age, I had serious <coughs> money problems too. So I know how it feels all too well. <laughs> alright, alright, look. Here's the deal, just for you. I'll cut you a special Ooh. price of 3,000 rupees. Much better. But in return, I'm going to need you to bring me 30 wood bundles, building materials, you know how it is. Anyway, you understand the terms, then get to it and show me what you're built out of. That's a construction joke. <laughs> you're not funny. Hudson, Carson, stop what you're doing. You got it. You got it. Sorry, sleep time, baby. See you later. Already? Well, it is. You weren't even doing anything. How could you be tired? Sledgehammer. Damn it. Ho! Also, that iron sledgehammer will return constantly, so you can come back here and pick it up again later. Not just that one, but this one, too. Yeah. As a matter of fact, 
You already have two. Throw away your axe. No, it's good for cutting wood. We're gonna need a lot of wood. As a matter of Maybe. fact, I bet there's a tree around here I can chop down and get some wood. How close are we the anyways? Apple tree. Indeed. Apple tree, give me lots of apples! Or, you know, just fall over. You know, whatever works. How much wood do I have now, anyway? Good question. You have not that much. 20, actually, we almost have what we need already. But you don't have the rupees for it, do you? No. Nope, not even close. Well, I'm going to need a lot of rupees. Oh, it's raining. I would say that you're actually pretty close, considering that you have over a thousand, at least. I'm going to take that amber. Alright, I think it's very important that I hit up that shrine so I have a way to fast travel here. Yes. Anyway, when I said this house is kind of used, it's because it's where they go at night. I think. Ooh, I didn't realize Wait, that. Wait, what? What are you doing? He Bullsy? is, but they're probably both the tree. Yeah. Oh, I guess the, only, the other two are the only ones that go in the house. Ooh. Hello. What, what are, are you doing? doing? I'm on lookout. By the way, I forgot the voice I gave him a minute ago. What? what? Are you gonna buy the house? Yeah. <laughs> You're pretty uh, studly. <laughs> You're pretty studly, aren't you? What? Uh? Hey, that was more than one word, Robert. You'd be great at hire for our company. What's your name? Linkson. Linkson? Oh, well, too bad. Can't hire you. Why? Because your name doesn't end in son. Son? The boss, Bolson, has a strict hiring rule. Need a name ending in son. No exceptions. That's too bad. Builds Team Unity, Unity, he says. Anyway, you got some stuff to do, right? Should get going, then. Bye. Bye. Stop, Stop. standing in the fire! I want to see if rain puts fires out. It does! <laughs> yeah, but not before cooking you. Just just, just a little toasty. My Builds character. <laughs> Alright, let's do a shrine. I'm trying to think what shrine this is. Heck, if I can remember. Uh, yeah, it's yeah, probably yeah, not yeah. going to be that hard. I doubt it. I need a lot of money. Oh, boy. You need, you need a little need... under 2,000 rupees. About three times what you have now. I need to make money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's actually a really easy way to make money. Oh, no. Oh, this ain't bad. Stop whining. I got so frustrated I kept failing, I just gave up for about two days. I'm having a brain fart. What is this one? Oh, yeah. This, this is one. a tilt puzzle. I am so glad I have a pro controller and don't have to go grab my freaking gamepad. Goodbye. There we go. <laughs> oh, wait. That didn't fix anything. Maybe out right there. Don't get rid of by the balls. I've got balls of fail. There we go. Now I can open the chest. But now you gotta get back out of here. A Fenric bow. Uh, I think that said the... Frenic. Whatever. And I believe those bows shoot straight. Extremely straight. Well, everything else will, you know, fall after a little bit. I don't think they do. There's okay, of... I solved the puzzle. Let me in. <laughs> There's plenty of long-range uh, bows in this game, though. Okay, yeah, I definitely remember this puzzle now. This one was so freaking irritating. But it should be a lot easier to do with this controller instead of the gamepad. As balls just keep falling. Balls to the floor. Well, that didn't work out. Oh, hey, get back over there. Hell. Yep. Come on, roll that ball like a champ. Nope. Bye. Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> <laughs> what were you trying to do there? I was going to try to thwack it over like a ping pong ball. Makes me wonder if that's even possible. Too far! <laughs> I kind of cheat a little. I just catch it in this spot. 
I did the same thing. I don't remember how I succeeded though. Like that? No. <laughs> it's really hard to tell where this spot is over here. Yeah. If only this had a 3D function. Hey, I think that may. Dang it! Wah, 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 wah. Do we gotta put in a fail counter? How about that? I think that did it. Yay! That Hooray! Did it. And as long as you land it on the ramp, it's guaranteed to open the door. May as well go to the, uh. Unless you do this. <laughs> I was hoping that I'd knock it out and trap myself in here. Actually, I'm not even sure if that can work. Hmm. Alright, I got another chesticle down the hatch. Time to get light needles in your eye. Ah! Ah, I can't see! Your resource on this bottle of huh? Spirit Orb. Seven! And we're free! Alright, I want to do one last thing before I end this episode off. I'm in dire need of money, and I have an amiibo here that can summon me money. I think I'll use it. You know it'd be funny? What's that? Instead of summoning you a money, it summoned what was on the thing and it started attacking you. That would be epic, and I would hate it so much at this moment in time. <laughs> yeah. Uh, or if it followed it's a 50, you. It's a 50-50 chance of some, either summoning a, an enormously strong monster, or just giving you a ton of money. A low battery warning! That's what it gave us. Dang you, battery meter. Ah, uh, and foot. Ow! Ancient battle axe. Hey, I'll take it. That's actually a really good weapon. Let's no see kidding. here. Throw away your torch. Or keep the torch. <laughs> Why would I would? I would have kept one of those though. <laughs> you <laughs> you got two hurt more. myself again. Exactly, and there's like two more over there right now. Fair. Yeah. I'll try again. <laughs> Whee! Just Dude, how I planned it. One, or no money whatsoever. Opal. Opal is money. Opal counts. It's cash. Whoosh. Seems opponent couldn't hear your call. Five arrows. It said I couldn't pick something up. What was it? Uh. I don't know. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode, ladies and gentlemen. In the next, we will do some stuff and some things. See you next time. What? I had to die sometime. <laughs>